Right guys, welcome back to the channel of Sprout here. In today's video, I'm going to give you an easy money guide for Marauders. Now, there's a certain um, strategy I use that I'm going to give away in this video, which should get you something similar to this quite often. Now, I can't promise you that you're going to get 1.5 million loot every time with four kills, but it will help. So, this guide is shown on Windswept Harbour, however, it does apply to all three maps, and I'll talk you through it as I go. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Right guys, in this specific instance, I'm going to go to Garage, uh, the gas station, I've just marked it on the map there. Now, on factory, you want to go to the officers. On Mount Hitiyama, whatever, you need to go to the main villa. Now, since you're a marauder, the other marauders don't attack you. So, the misconception of some people is, let's just shoot every single one you see. Now, I'm going to tell you, these ones specifically, you know, the ones that just roam around, just ignore them. Don't shoot them. The more you shoot... The more of them start retaliating to you. And if you haven't got any decent gear on your marauder, you're going to get killed very quickly. Now, I treat these runs as sort of an opportunist run. Now, you've spawned 10, 15 minutes after the players have spawned. So, there's going to be a lot of dead bodies everywhere. What you want to do is check all the dead bodies as you're running. I can't guarantee you'll find something nice. But as you know, you, the players can't carry everything from their kills. Now, I'm just literally going from where I spawned to... The most popular bit on the map which is the gas station i know there's going to be a lot of dead bodies there or perhaps some loot left behind so that's where i go now this guy's on the road as well in front of us here i'm just going to ignore him make sure you try and follow people without being seen and you don't want to like get into a commentation unless you're very confident you're going to do something now this guy i was very lucky in this match ran into the commander sorry i'm not shooting that one uh, he ran into the command and actually got downed. So I was very lucky in what I found here. There was actually a player, etc, uh, etc. Et now, when you spawn with a marauder, right, don't spawn with a shotgun. And here's why, right? Because I only kill commanders and elites. You can tell them apart by how they look. Obviously, the helmet is the giveaway. The good bots have hoods on, not a helmet. That's the ones you want to kill. There's the command I see. Now, any... At that time, it would be quite hard to kill him. But because he's not facing us, it makes it a hell of a lot easier to kill him and take his stuff. Now, I'm focusing on guns here. I'm going to drop the moors in I spawned with. I'm going to pick up some uh, of our decent stuff just so that I've got all the best gear possible. And then you still head towards the main objective where you've marked on the map, of course. But this is this is called like opportunist scavenging. So, you're finding things on the floor that are expensive and you're picking it up because you know it'll sell or even sell to the vendor for quite a high price. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and kill this commander because he's not looking at us. So, it's kind of easy to kill him, you know what I mean? There we go, Commander Abraham, gone. And he actually had a really good M4, which you can see there, that puts straight in my bag. And that actually sold at auction on the black market for half a million so that was a really good one you know what i mean make sure you get all the best gear you can now i've only killed one marauder so chances are the other marauders won't shoot us just yet so i should be able to get to where i'm going relatively easily so after you've done this opportunist thing just remember ignore the bots don't shoot them unless you have to if they start shooting you for whatever reason you've accidentally misfired then fair enough kill them but just ignore them. They don't drop anything decent half the time. It's not worth dying over, especially on a marauder, because, you know, you can't see a slot anything. Everything you pick up, you have to escape with. So you need to be on the on the safe side. Now, I'm going to continue to where I'm going. I'm going to loot things on my way. There's a suitcase there. Obviously, it had a splint, and I'm not going to pick that up. There's another dead body. Nothing on that. See, that's sentry ones. The point is killing all the sentries, because they don't drop anything. Now, here I am at the gas station. Just gonna have a look around, see what there is, lying about all these corpses and stuff. Check 
the obvious places like the locked room at the back, the side rooms, just making sure that nobody's left anything behind that's of value. Let's check in here. There's obviously a lot in here if you want to get the key. But I'm not picking up stuff that's massive. It's going to take up loads of slots. You know, I just want stuff that's expensive I can sell, even if I just quick sell it. It doesn't look like it's really anything there. I'm not dropping the guns. I've got to pick up them guns. That would be completely ridiculous. So there's nothing really else around. Mark has only 5k. Point is picking that up. Don't worry about filling your storage completely because you've just found these guns. You know what I mean? Guns are the main thing on Marauder runs. You can just sell them. Some some of them sell for like 60k. Some of them sell for 200k. Just quick selling. And that's what's good. Now once I've been to this main place, this is when I just go to extract. It's pointless looking around more because that's when you get the other player Marauders. Uh, players remain and stuff that will find you and kill you. You just want to go straight to extract. And if you want to kill marauders on the way, as long as you're close to the extract, you know you've got quite a high chance of getting away, then go for it, kill them, see what little gear they've got, see if there's got anything on them a bit more expensive. But this is how you do it safely to know you're going to escape. Obviously, you are going to kill one, make sure you get behind them so that they're took by surprise, you know what I mean? No, but he didn't really have much. I will take the shampoo. Because I'm trying to craft keys. I've got time to look in here. To make sure nobody's opened the supply crate. But I didn't bother anyway at that time. So, run to the extract. Escape. All your stuff. And repeat. You get four marauders a day. Just, if you have got the money to re-roll, do not go in with a shotgun. You go in with a sniper rifle. It's quite easy to walk right up to a commander or right up to an elite and shoot them in the back of the head. One shot kill. You know what I mean? It's very easily. And so, there we go. If you've enjoyed this video, guys, I hope you find it helpful. Do leave a like on the video. Make sure you do also subscribe to the channel. And I will be pumping out more guides and gameplays as time goes on. So thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.